Hello friends and welcome back. Today I'm going to share with you my newest kit that came to the shop. I am going to start carrying the Hobonichi Weeks. You're going to see it in the same artwork that I have for all of my other kits. It'll be one of the regular releases. So I did pick up Hobonichi Weeks because I've been trying to find my planner piece when it comes to certain things and everything for me doesn't fit in one planner. So I'll explain exactly what I'm doing with my Hobonichi as we go along. The other thing I picked up um, was a happy planner because I, first of all, it was on sale. They were 50% off at Michael's, and I love the artwork. I love this beautiful foiled cheetah print. Um, all the different pages are absolutely gorgeous. It's still got that vertical, which I absolutely love. So I'm going to make vertical Happy Planner um, kits for this using, again, the, the, as each artwork comes out, it'll be available for each and every one of these sizes. And then I'm going to show you real quick what I have here for you. So these are three pages. The weekly kits. I'm going to work on monthly too. I haven't I haven't done that yet. But it's all that same artwork. This is the Cafe Girl one. Um, and you've got pretty much, I think, everything and then some of what you need for one week in the Hobonichi. I also made this page, which is my favorite page out of all of them. I wanted to make sure that you had your matching icons and they are scaled way down to fit inside the Hobonichi. And some scripts, which... Um, I'm going to change those out depending on what I'm doing, but for this particular one, I needed it for, I wanted to have a lot of like Instagram, YouTube, stuff like that, shoppings, to-dos, importance, etc. This is how the inside of the Hobonichi looks in case you don't have one and you're thinking about it. This is it before it gets all stickered up. I love the size. I love how easy it's going to be for me to um, keep track of exactly what I want for this. So my idea for this, um, I'm going to speed this up. So you'll just have to kind of, every once in a while, I'll chime in and let you know something that I messed up on. Like right now, that should happen second because when I, actually I think I'm going to fix it. I'm going to probably go in and resize my dividers to fit after you put down your date because everybody always goes, it's, it's almost like we get in a pattern of how we put together our pages and for me it's always date covers bottom washi top washi and then i start decorating around it with all of my boxes or my sidebars or whatever depending on what planner i'm using and i did the same thing here but when i designed the kit i designed it from one end of the page to the other so my dividers are actually go from line to line and so they're a little bit longer because they're meant to go down before you put down the dates. So I'm going to fix that. So when you see me get to that part where I'm trimming them down, you won't need to do that because all of the dividers will be sized to fit inside of those areas and you won't have to actually trim anything after this because this is a little weekend divider and you can see there it's a little bit longer on one side because I measured it from the outside of, oh, don't even, it's, it's a process, but that will be fixed before they go up for sale. So no worries. Actually, they'll be fixed before you even see this video. So anyway, here are all of the little divider boxes. And I'm going to put one in between every page or, I mean, in between every day. Or you can leave it blank. Doesn't matter. However you want to put it down. The long bar on the side with all the individual boxes I thought would be a great place for two things. So Hobonichi for me had two purposes. I think I'm going to use it as... A social media tracker because that's the one thing I've been struggling to find is a place to track social media and stay on top of videos and Instagramming and all that kind of stuff. But you can also use that sidebar there, which I'm going to use it for in this one, is a meal planner, which is what I'm going to use it for. You can use it for budgeting. You can use this whole thing for budgeting. So I think for that fun function, that fun little page where all the icons are and the scripts are, I'm going to have a budgeting option. So instead of things like Instagram, YouTube shopping, important to do, clean, blah, 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 it'll have budgeting um, to save, to buy, to no spend, stuff like that. So you'll see a budgeting version or an everyday version or a social media version. So I will start working on that so that you can, because everybody uses Hobo for different reasons, and I think that's what mine's going to be for. You can see here on my trackers, I've got YouTube, Instagram, and then the bottom one is shopping, and that's actually shop shopping. <laughs> so whenever I'm buying things, I'm going to check it off so that I know to go back in my actual budgeting um, book and mark off as things are paid 
as that I don't know if that makes sense but I guess if you're a shop owner you know what I mean like when you buy ink and paper and shipping supplies and all that good stuff um, I'm just gonna track that I bought stuff that week so that I can make sure I go back and add them to it's almost like doing a checkbook from like way back when we actually had checkbooks so now I'm just going to start decorating each and every one of these little columns here. I've got my notes page up there. I'm going to have um, fun with all of the deco, which is another thing that will be in all of these kits. We'll have the matching deco sized way down to hobo size. I love putting offsetting boxes. I just think it makes the pages look so much better. I've got a birthday here on the 5th. So I'm going to use that box to mark a birthday, and you can see in the icons there I've got cakes and presents and stuff, so you can definitely mark pretty much anything you want in here. Those also icons will work good on the monthly page, but I haven't haven't um, figured out if I even want to do a monthly, because I just, I just don't know. Um, I actually get the kits from Coco Daisy every month, and the Hobonichi is one of the things that I have in the kits, and that's the monthly... So I would never use it, and it seems like, you know, there's so many options out there for downloadable monthlies that I don't know if it's even worth making. I don't know. You guys let me know. You let me know if you think that I should add the monthly page to it or if the weekly is enough because um, I, I don't want to, I don't know. I think I would have to include it with this whole, like make it a whole bundle together because it just doesn't seem worth one page because it literally would be one page so now I'm just putting down all of my things that I know that I need to do so I know I have a doctor's appointment on the first to go to I've got blood work so our hospital decided to um, track the heroes I guess <laughs> so that's what they call it so all of the it's optional you don't have to do it but they're gonna test us for the COVID antibodies to see how many of us have been exposed and if we have antibodies or not so my appointment is at that time on that day and then hubby and I are gonna have a little date night afterwards and on the menu planner you can see I've got all the little icons there I've got my little cooking pot at the top and then I have the thing that says meal plan and then I have the little um, uh, what do you call that food truck because that's a day that we're gonna go out to eat and then I love using these little bows and clips on the boxes so I just kind of attached them before I put the box down more of the deco and now I'm gonna take this away and then come back and show you it all filled in I used a bunch of different um, little deco pieces from like paper shire there's some from like happy bees some of my own and then I just kind of wrote down all of the things that I need to do all of the things that are going to happen this week and um, yeah so this is what it looks like after the pen and ready to go for the whole week of first week of September so I hope you guys really like this kit I hope you um, I don't know I just I, <laughs> I'm just having so much fun making these things that I just can't stop so hopefully you guys are enjoying them and you like these videos and if you do give me a thumbs up give me some comments let me know what you like what you don't like and I will try to accommodate as much as I can in these kits if there's something that you think I should add please let me know um, I'm always open to suggestions I've got all kinds of like new stuff coming up so keep a watch out um, you're gonna see some more plan with me's and yep yeah, that's pretty much it so I hope you guys have a fabulous week and I will see you again very very soon with another plan with me or the new release or who knows what whatever's coming up next have a great day bye bye